Now, Paul, and we're talking about the supernatural business, so part, partnering is, is part of that as a business. Now, you don't tithe out of your business. You tithe out of what you take out of your business and spend. But you sow out of your business for increase. You sow out of it. It's not legally a tithe. You could call it that, but it's not li- really a tithe. A tithe is what you pay taxes on. It's what you spend, what you personally use. Your business you know, that's a business. It's its own separate entity, probably. S-Corp, LLC, right? If you take money out of it, then you pay taxes on it, right? Then you, then you tithe on that. But the business, you sow out of. Not any really clapping going on or anything, but... <laughs> Listen, I'm just talking about getting Jesus in the boat with you, man. You're not even clapping about it. I'm saying you got you to gotta sow out of your business into into the assignments God leads you to, to tap into that anointing. Get your business involved with the things of God, man. So into the kingdom out of your business, and God, Jesus, is in your boat. All right? That's the first thing we saw in that story. Paul said, you can receive words of knowledge. 1 Corinthians 14. Jesus told them where the fish were, and he'll tell you as well. In fact, it's one of the gifts of the nine gifts of the Holy Spirit for the church. Words of knowledge, things you didn't know. So how do, how do I tap into that, Pastor? 1 Corinthians 14. If you pray in a tongue, pray in a tongue. Uh, second verse, 14. For anyone who speaks in a tongue does not speak to people but to God. Indeed, no one understands them. They utter mysteries by the Spirit. But the one who prophesies speaks to people for their strengthening, encouragement, comfort. Anyone who speaks in a tongue edifies themselves. Edify means bring instruction, revelation. God gave us this secret language, so to speak, secret from the devil, that God can download mysteries under the devil's nose. He doesn't know what's going on. All right, so edification. You need that in business, right? The location, over there in the deep water. The method, the net. The harvest, the fish. Now, I said it was backwards. We need to reverse this because you can't do it that direction. You have to go backwards. Hang with me. Let's understand what I said last night. The harvest is not money. It is what you're going to monetize into money. In the, earth, in the earth, all money is created by buying and selling. You've got to have something that affects commerce somehow to, to create wealth. And so you don't want to, you, you're not looking for money, you're looking for what produces money. That's what you're praying for, an idea. <laughs> 